Previously we made a video on changing background in Adobe Premiere Pro and today we are going to change the background without green screen in Adobe After Effects. We will be using Roto Brush to rotoscope the object, uh, the actor, the person in the video. Here we have the actor footage and the background we will use. Here this footage has a man walking in the street and we are going to use roto brush to get him cropped out from the street and place him in the background after selecting the roto brush we have to double click on the layer and the layer will be opened here we have to select our object or the person after selecting you can see a selection is done and the selection is not precise we have to make the selection correct the useful key bindings for the selection is if you just click with the green button the roto brush will select object and if you press alternate alt key plus mouse click the roto brush will inverse the selection here we are making the selection perfect and perfecting the edges of the video the video has already changed it changed its background and uh, person is placed on the background scene you can see there and pressing the space button the Adobe After Effects will automatically adjust the scenes and the movement but you have to stop by pressing space and track automatically where the system fails then press space again and the uh, system will detect scenes in a while it may take a longer time so the best solution is to use green screen green screen is very easy to use and takes no time in file editing Firstly, we tracked the footage where the actor was not moving too much and now we are going to track the footage where actor is walking and moving every frame. It is a very lengthy process. You have to check the selection every frame so that it is very much precise. After the editing and rotoscoping is done our actor will look like this we have to correct the position and scaling in the background to make it realistic and we will have to change the brightness and contrast so that the actor blends with the background this scaling and position looks perfect we are going with this and now it's time for adjusting the brightness and contrast from the right effects and presets panel we can search for brightness and contrast and drag it over the layer you can adjust the uh, brightness and contrast until the actor blends with the background background lighting and positioning and now we will need to add some shadow to make the actor realistic we will be using real shadow it is a stock effect in the adobe after effects now changing the position shadow position will do the trick 
you will have to match the other shadow positions to make it look realistic and change the opacity also the shadow position can be corrected from the left panel or you can use the positioning stick in the video to correct your shadow position after correcting the shadow brightness and finalizing the rotoscoping you will have your result and thank you for watching please do subscribe